Hi, my name is Richard Keeler. I'm the Senior Vice President of Community Development here at Kettler. Today, I'm going to give you some insight on the life cycle of our land development projects. For those of you who don't know, the Kettler land team turns big parcels of land into little parcels of land and sells them at a profit. While that is a very simplistic statement, it is the essence of what we do. Land development jobs are typically broken into five stages. The first stage is feasibility. In this stage, we determine if a particular parcel of land can be developed into what we envision. If there are any unusual attributes of the subject property that would adversely affect the project, like wetlands impacts or contaminated soils, and if the proposed development works from a financial perspective after considering all the previously mentioned conditions. If we get past feasibility, we move on to entitlement. The entitlement stage is the most important and most difficult stage in a land project. Now is when we attempt to rezone the property. In this stage, we work with community groups, local politicians, and county staff to determine if what we envision for the project and what they envision align. Now that we have a plan that works and everyone is happy, we are off to the plan approval stage. The plan approval stage is always fun. Our engineers spend a lot of time taking our approved rezoning concept plans into full construction plans. These are then submitted to the jurisdiction for review and approval. During this stage, we are talking to site contractors and getting pricing and eventually getting to a contract. So we're ready to start construction as soon as our plans are approved. After several rounds of comments from the jurisdictional staff, we get plan approval, then we move into the construction stage. The construction stage is where the rubber meets the road. We start by clearing the land, then install erosion and sediment controls, followed up by mass grading of the site. Then comes the installation of the sanitary sewer, storm sewer, and water lines. After all the utilities are installed, we pour curb and gutter, stone the roadways, then pave the roads. After paving is complete, we are ready to deliver finished building pads to our builder. After the first pads are delivered to the builder, they build a model unit, then they start to sell units. This is when we move into the lot sales stage. The lot sales stage is when all of our hard work starts to pay off. The proceeds from the lot sales are used to pay off any loans we have for the purchase of the land and the cost of construction. When these amounts are paid off, the ownership starts to get a return on the project. After all the lots are sold, we close out the project and are on to the next job. So that is a quick snapshot of what we do here in the Community Development Department at Kettler.